I didn't see you there. Well, 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 well. I've been expecting you. <laughs> Welcome to my new segment, Sit Downs with Mom. I have here my serious glasses and I cannot see shit. I'm going to be teaching you today manners and knowledge. People of the world, I will be showing you explicit before and after pictures of the transformation of my body. We will be talking about how I lost weight after giving birth. That's right. After making a human inside of me and then pushing it out of my own body. This time I actually want to help anybody who's having the same problem as me, which is lose weight. Bless my soul. I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. Every day, once a day, give yourself a present. Don't plan it, don't wait for it, just let it happen. Hi guys, today is gonna be a little sit down with mom. It's gonna be a serious video with all its serious seriousness, seriously. So, before, I was a really fat kid I, and my mom, parang, she's had enough. Like, I've had it. You're too fat. Red meal, once a day. One cup of rice, every meal. Sometimes, pag ako pa yung gagawa ng cup ko, talaga sinisiksik ko talaga. You said one cup. Pero yung siksik, kaya gano'n, no? Kahit na may kumukontak sa nanay ko, wala siyang pake. Ito ang gagawin mo ako yung nanay mo. So yeah, at that time of my life, hindi kami okay ni mommy. Awang-awa ako sa sarili ko. Feeling ko hindi niya ako mahal. Gano'n nung nag-isip mga bata, diba? That's one thing I'm grateful to my mom every single day. Mas wala siyang pake sa sinabi ng ibang tao, ako yung iniisip niya. So, I hated exercising. I hated that shit. I hated feeling like dying, especially when you're jogging. Tapos hinga lang hinga ka, de ba? Pero meron na ako na discover na I enjoy ko yung hip hop dance, hip hop abs. Imagine my young self, just fat, malaki ng braso ko, crunch, crunch. Five more, and as a kid, I would be like, yeah, I so much fun, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I enjoyed that. So you know when you lose weight, sobrang na encourage ka, and you do stuff by yourself. So first year high school. How do I get thin without exercising? And Google pointed me to the way of Dr. Atkins, the one who discovered the Atkins diet. So it said there that you can lose weight by just eating meat. You don't have to exercise because the meat will give you the protein, you get the muscles for it. Disclaimer lang, this is not a how to lose weight. I'm just telling you guys how I did mine. I'm not saying any facts because I ain't no scientist. Also, I'd like to say sorry in advance to my dad. It went before pics, my after pics then. I'm sorry, daddy. Please don't move pala Let's get down to business. My unhealthy relationship with food started when I started the Atkins diet because that made me lose a sh ton of weight. I realized, hey, during the weekdays, I can not eat shit and then weekends, I can eat cake and then I can just start over. So don't unhealthy, don't do this. It's not the right way of doing Atkins diet. It's not even a real way. It's just my unhealthy way of trying to still eat yummy food while being in the Atkins diet. So I lost weight there, but my weight goal is like super easy to change. Like I eat something. You know what I mean. My goal weight in high school was 110 pounds. I was 116. And I felt like if I reached 110 pounds, damn, I'd be the most beautiful I'd ever be. Because at that time, the lower your weight was, the prettier you were. Not long ago, high school life, I was like not eating in the weekdays and eating crap on the weekends. It was mostly what I did. Because my dad would get really mad when he saw that I didn't eat food. Why did I eat food? You know, dads, what are you gonna do? So anyway, come college, I'm feeling 116 pounds. Independent way of living in Manila. College, dorming, budget, allowance, own life, single being, no parents, yeah. I struggled with the average of 130 pounds my whole college life. That was insane to me. I was like, holy shit, I am so fat. <laughs> The problem was I did not focus on eating meat and fats. I focused on eating absolutely nothing. I would eat queso de bola and drink tea when I was hungry and then I would jog at night. <laughs> And I would almost faint. I was really unhealthy in college. I still gained weight. So after college, I graduated. I felt like I was okay. I was in the state na parang content na sa katawan ko. I wasn't like really confident, but I was okay with it. I thought to myself, na 20 years old, if this is your body forever, I'm fine. You're pretty. You have a good personality. You're a little funny. You're good. You don't have to change anything about yourself. The reason why I thought like that, sobrang tamad ko exercise. I love food talaga. I, I swear, food can change my mood. Kahit na sobrang lungkot ko, if I eat the food that I want, the world is a beautiful. Place. Place. Everything has color. I was good with what I looked like. And then, um, I got pregnant. Cheers. 
2017, baby. <laughs> the year my life changed forever, ever, ever. The year Majo came into my cute little life. I'm here, bitches. I'm here. What's up? <laughs> Everybody, make way. I have arrived. I got pregnant 20 years old. Yeah. For some people, this is the end. I will become Loshan forever. And I hate it. I hate it. Can you shut the f up? I literally just made human life. I did that. Well, of course, I gained a little weight. I was making Mako in my tummy, creating his eyeballs. It's a tough job. Making other humans. So, as I was creating human life, I gained one or two pounds. A lot of pounds. I gained a lot of pounds. I was the fattest I've ever been in my whole life. So, yeah, I gave birth. My mom was like, you're fine. Breastfeed, baby. Breastfeed. Feed. I did not breastfeed because of my oh man nutrition for the baby. Yeah, okay, that's a plus. I breastfed for myself to be honest. So after I gave birth, I just felt like shit. Basically, all I felt I was overweight, my tahe ako, and there was this baby constantly needing me 24/7. And babies, they don't latch kaagad. It's like a constant struggle finding the correct position and just correct. You wake up at the middle of the night to breastfeed, and then and the baby doesn't know how to latch yet. And the baby's just like, eh, I'm hungry, and then you're just like, just drink. <laughs> I don't know how. And then pull it all it down the cycle, and then you're just tired, feeling ugly, feeling like shit, and there's the wound in your vagina, <laughs> and that's just basically the first months of my postpartum. Oh, can I also say, before I gave birth, I had a big lump here. It was full of milk, bro. I was like, what is this? I did not sign up for this. Yes. Tapas, did you know that your breasts, when it's full of milk, it's like hell. Oh my gosh, what a nightmare to remember. <laughs> no, 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 breastfeeding is not like all like. I love you, baby. It is a beautiful thing, breastfeeding. The feeling that we latch na siya and got each other's rhythms figured out. So, first three months of me breastfeeding, I lost a lot of weight really quick. I was eating the whole time. Rice, 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 baby! The good thing about breastfeeding is you have an excuse to always eat. Because like when your body makes milk, it burns calories. It was so fun! But then there was a time where I wasn't losing the calories that I was gaining. Because I was eating too much na. This was about meha. I remember clear as day, that's when I started intermittent fasting. Ding, the savior of my life. So moms, don't ever think that you won't lose weight. That's a really big misconception that everybody has to stop thinking. Di porget nanay ka na. Doesn't mean you can't achieve the best version of you. Because I achieved the best version of myself after giving birth to Mako. Stop eating at 8 p.m. Start eating 12 p.m. So I did that. Boy, did I lose weight. <laughs> I lost a lot of weight with intermittent fasting plus breastfeeding. It was so easy. Eat a lot of protein, eat less rice, eat in your window, exercise a little bit, and then at night, pagtulog na si Mako. I will be doing weights and just like following Angel Days. The workout niya. Three months after I bought Muriel Weldon's first home guide, I pushed myself. If I could do heavier weights, I would do heavier weights. When somebody asks me what they should do, I, I tell them to start with one thing, like take off flavored drinks. Try it for like a week long. You'll be feeling so amazing, and then you're gonna wanna maybe jog for 30 minutes a day. Then tuloy tuloy na yan. When you start feeling so good in the inside and start seeing changes on the outside, sobra na kaadi. Around August, I discovered the brand Whale. Ding. Ah, they sell protein shakes. So I tried it because they have flavors like caramel, salted chocolate, double berry. I was like, whoa! I thought protein shakes only have like vanilla and chocolate, but like melon? I gotta try that. The first flavor I ordered was caramel. Imagine losing weight and eating amazing food at the same time. Mind blowing. Every day I would look forward to drinking my drink. Fresh milk all the time. Everybody else was doing it with water. But I was thinking that it's better than if I drink it with fresh milk and I enjoy my drink. Parang yun na dessert ko for the day. I'm not saying do this, do this, do this, and you lose weight. I'm saying this is what I did. You can try it. Might lose weight. So yeah, I'm thankful for all the hardships that happened to me. Because I realized I can do it and I can do it greatly. I can freaking slay that sh. I can just bring it. I brought it. You know what I mean? This is what I look like when I was a Fat kids. Ding. Keep it coming, keep it coming. So that was me. No pero pa yata ng mom ko. And this is what I look like after. Ding. Yes. And then after college. Ding. Then this is what I look like pregnant. Ding. Yeah. And I'm so sorry, daddy, but I'm gonna have to show what I look like now. Still under construction, but I'm pretty happy where I am now. It hasn't been easy, and I never knew that I would ever reach this day in my life. Na masaya ako sa katawan ko. I was so lazy before. I was so lazy. I was okay with my body. I just eh, okay na to. Also, if you see a woman that is pregnant, don't you dare tell her 
that she gained weight. You literally just told somebody who's making life that she gained weight. No shit, Sherlock. <laughs> there are really people out here doing that. I mean, there's a way to encourage people to lose weight, and it's not by telling them, Tabamuna. No, you're not encouraging them to lose weight. You're giving them a bad time. Don't don't pretend that you care. Nobody's buying it. So, number one, if you see a woman who has gained a little weight, do you think it is your job to tell them? Or do you think they wake up every morning knowing that? So yeah, if you see another girl who is pregnant, has just been pregnant, or who is a mother, or simply just gained weight. Shut up, man! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Do the world a favor and shut up! Just take your mouth and sh just shut it. Don't just don't say anything. Close it and do not make sounds with your mouth. That's all. The world will be a better place without you telling other people that they gained weight. So um Let's move on to the taste testing of my protein shake. Hello everybody, it is the next day of my video and we are working with six flavors today. We have the Mighty Matcha, Salted Chocolate, Mocha Java, Mint Chip, Brown Boba, and Naked White. All right, so I'll get back to you when we're all settled down. Goodbye. Hey there, we're back and we are gonna finally let Lara try the matcha protein shake. This is whale hose just protein shake and I mixed it with 8 ounces of fresh milk and 1 tablespoon of chia seeds. So that is 33 grams of protein. Alright, first toast! Ooh, I like matcha. I don't taste the matcha. Crap, I put too much milk. My bad. I failed. How can you not taste the matcha, bro? But it's so good. For me, it's a 10 out of 10. Lara doesn't like matcha, so it's not counted. I'll be back with the next flavor. <laughs> hey y'all, I have now the chocolate protein shake. Let's let everybody taste it. Taste, 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 taste. Yeah, sure. Chocolate it? banana protein shake with milk. It's actually very good. Like <laughs> hey there, Puyano protein shake. Hey there, Puyano. I made my own. <laughs> Okay, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Hi. It is a new day and we are gonna be trying... Protein shake! <laughs> I have nobody here with me in the office, so it is going to be me who is going to be taste testing the mocha java. But the difference is I have not tried this flavor yet. It's my first time. So I have here my mocha java. And I'm gonna try to make iced coffee with it. I have my mixture, I'm gonna pour it in ice. Watch me, baby. Ready, steady, ice coffee. I'm so excited to taste this. Mm. It's good, it's really good. I don't even have to tell you, look at the color. Mm. I'm having this every day. All right, mm, mm, mm. yeah, work, bye-bye. Hello. It's not gonna try because she doesn't like mint chip. I don't like mint chip, but I'm adventurous like that. Anyway, all right. Or you like protein, it's good, bro. You get to see I love it, it's really good. I can down this in like 30 seconds. Chia seeds hit the spot. It's just a pleasure to drink. It's just I want more. 10 out of 10. Bye. We're gonna eat now. So now we have our brown boba, and now we will mix, mix until you see that color. Very beautiful. Now we put in the chia seeds. We plop it in there, and we make it submerge so that it can absorb the liquid. We put it in the ref so it will be cold. Hi guys, welcome back to Leah and Mako's cooking show. Mako is gonna help us make our naked white strawberry banana dream. What's this? Yeah, fresh milk. And we have here, what's this? Yes. And we have here, what's this? Yes, bananas. Advanced. Here. Put it inside. Okay. This is our brown boba protein drink with chia seeds. Lovely. And that is my son. What is, what is going on here? Okay. Sir, I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. Taste, 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 taste. How'd you make this? Damn. Yup. Yeah. Mako wants to give him some. I'll give you first. <laughs> Yay, approved. Nice, 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 nice. Sweet. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> you funny boy. So this one, my friends, is a vanilla strawberry yogurt banana drink. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yummy. What do you like more? Nice. So I am the one who is downing the yogurt drink. It's my favorite. Back to you, Leah. Thank you for sitting down with mama. Keep slaying. Don't let anybody bring you down because everybody else is ugly and you're not. I hope you learned a little manners. Stop telling people they're fat. They know. See you next episode. Bye-bye.